guys, Natalie Jill here. Welcome to Happy, Healthy, and Fit. Today we are working full body, full body, with a stability ball. Now, if you don't have a stability ball, I highly suggest getting them because you can work your whole body with them and they are great for that core functional fitness. So I love stability balls. But if you don't have one today and you still wanna work out with me, then you can still do the exercises without them. Just gonna make it a little bit better with them, with the stability ball. But you can also grab a towel and you could do same exercises with a towel on a floor. It'll just be a little bit lower with all the exercises. Or if you've got carpeting, you can use paper plates on the carpet and you can do a lot of these exercises with me. Okay, so if you've got it, the first exercise we're gonna do, because we're working full body, is we're gonna do a reverse lunge with the ball. So let me show you this first. You're gonna put your foot on the ball here. We're going to squat down while driving the ball backwards like this. Okay, are you ready? Foot up on the ball, face leg planted, and we're gonna take it back. Down and out. Really feeling that in that glute. Woo! As you're bringing it in. So reverse lunge, pushing the stability ball back. Got this. And take a lot of these and you'll really feel it. And I'm just putting my arms out in front to help with the balance. So you want to think strong. Nothing sloppy here. Everything's strong, controlled. Okay, all the way back. And I'm just going to turn this here so you can see what I'm doing a little bit more. Taking it all the way back here and back up. Last two. One. Nice. Shake it out. All right, same thing, other side. Leg up on the ball. Get your balance here. Take it out and hand ready. Take it back. And really working that glute on that base leg. Use your heel to drag you in. So the foot on top of the ball is literally just resting there. So you're using that glute as you're squatting down, pushing that ball back. You should really feel that. Back and out. Nice job. Two more. Last one. Nice job. Good job, guys. Shake it out. Right, giving that lower half a rest. I'm gonna grab that ball. We're gonna do a shoulder raise here. Watch me. You're gonna put your feet shoulder width distance apart. We're gonna lift it up and down. Slow and controlled, squeezing that ball together between those hands. Just got 10 total. Breathe through it. Working shoulders, working back. You're squeezing the ball. You're also getting your chest. Nice job. Two more. Last one. Nice job, you did it, good job. All right, shaking that out, we're gonna take it down to the ground. We're gonna take it down and we're gonna do a combined chest and ab move here. So watch me here, we're gonna get in a push-up position, hands on the ground, feet on the ball. Take it here. And we're gonna take it to a push-up, watch me first, push-up, and then tucking the ball in. Are you ready? Take it down and tuck. You got this. So give me five more good ones here. They should be hard. Keep going. Two more. Nice. Okay, don't give up. We've got our chest in action here, our abs squeezing here. We're going to take it to a pike. Watch me here. Roll it in. And then all the way out, pushing back here. Whoa. Get your chest and those abs. Ready? Just give me five of them. Take it to a pike up. Roll it back, push back. Nice. Up. Back, you got this. Three more. Two more. Last one. Nice job. Woo! That's hard, right? It doesn't take a lot, just a few exercises, concentrated moves, and you will really feel it. Moving on to the last exercise with the stability ball. Grab your mat again, fold it in half if you've got a long mat because you don't want the ball part on the mat. 
We're gonna lay down on our backs. Here. Feet up on the ball. Here. Pushing down, so you're getting the triceps involved here. You're gonna push down, and I want you to press into the ground, lifting your glutes up, so your triceps should stay clenched. The back of your arms, this whole move here, because you wanna work arms, full body. You're up here in a bridge. We're gonna use our hamstrings, and we're gonna draw the ball in. Are you ready? Take it in. Breathe in. Keep that butt up, keep those glutes up. Keep those hands pushed into the ground. You should feel it on those arms the whole time. Don't just rest there, you're not gonna work anything. Ignore the burning in the arms. Just notice it's there and work those hamstrings and those glutes. Using those heels, driving that ball back. Squeeze, squeeze. Nice job. Give me five more good ones here. Two more. Nice, hold it, let those arms out, shake them. Woo, let it down. Ah, <sighs> now take a nap, just kidding. <laughs> shake it out. Good job, everyone, you guys did it. Whoa, you should have felt that in your whole body. We started with shoulders, back, chest, got those triceps in action, legs, feeling good. See, it didn't take you that long, it was a short workout, all with a stability ball, you should feel it everywhere. Make sure you drink a lot of water right now. Walk it out. Don't just go take a nap. Walk it out, stretch it out, and I'll see you next time. Now don't forget, if you wanna get the best results, check out my programs below, especially the nutrition programs. Seven Day Jumpstart is gonna help you get to your results faster, teach you how to unprocess your diet. Bye guys.